First win on the board, you must be really chuffed. Yeah, we're stoked with that. Um, obviously, the other day was a bit of a tough loss for us, particularly with the bat, so it was nice to come out today and, and put a few runs on the board. I thought um, Sophia Dunkley was outstanding for us um, and a few good cameos to go along with her. And then, um, yeah, the bowling was exceptional. Obviously, Zoo um, to my left here was outstanding, taking four wickets. So, yeah, that's what we love to see. We love to see you guys dominating that, and it was a yeah, crucial win for us in the end. And what have you done between your loss the other day and today to maybe turn things around? Uh, we had a rest day, so <laughs> <laughs> sometimes the best thing to do is not a lot, no, but um, yeah, we had a day off, but we sort of, yeah, it wasn't our best day um, two days ago, and we sort of knew that. We had a, a chat this morning around um, some things that we could sort of do a little bit better, and I thought we, we, we did that today. We took that on board and, um, yeah, brought that out there today with the bat and then um, backed it up again with the ball. And Shizuka, player of the match for your four wickets, um, what was it like being out there for you and performing so well for your side? Uh, I just focus on now what I have to do. That's all. <laughs> it's all about the cricket for you. And you mentioned Sophie Eccleston is one of your heroes. Have you been getting tips from her during training? Uh, yes, uh, she advised me a bit for my bowling. And will everyone back home be watching and cheering you on? Uh, yes, and after first game, uh, some people message me, uh, yeah, support us a bit. And you're doing it for Japan, aren't you? Hope so. Yeah. <laughs> and so, Anu, obviously, you've got the bragging rights against your German teammate, Tina Goff. What was it like to get the win for you today? It was incredible. I think to, to bag a win is always nice. Um, and I think after the last game, we did come back strong then. I thought our bowling, batting, all departments were fantastic. And just to be in the center, uh, kind of soaking it all in, what a great experience. Yeah, and you say it's being out here soaking it all in, obviously alongside and against people you've not necessarily played with or against before. How much are you loving it? It's amazing. Sometimes you just have to pinch yourself because it's quite surreal and there's so much to learn on the field and off the field. So it's, uh, it's been amazing so far. Yeah, and Nicola, um, more runs for you today. Yeah. That must have been good. Mick, what was it like playing on the, the different wicket today? You were the first game on that one. Yeah, I thought it was a, a nice wicket. It seemed um, yeah, to be coming through nicely and a little bit different to the one that we played on the other day, obviously being a, a fresh wicket. Um, yeah, it was sort of, I mean, my job was pretty easy, done, sort of set the platform, and then I think Bismar and myself sort of got to have a bit of a hit and giggle at the back end there to sort of, yeah, get a few extra runs there. So I thought it was a really nice wicket, and um, yeah, I thought it was a pretty good game on a whole in the end. And have you found you've grown into your role as captain throughout the week? Um, I don't know, guys. <laughs> um, I actually found today a little bit more stressful, to be honest. I found the first game, I was so stressed about it, but then... It worked out okay, but Sophie Eccleston has um, been outstanding. She's sort of, I'm calling her my co-captain, unofficial co-captain, and obviously we've got Bismar in the side as well. So it's really handy having all those experienced players around me because, um, yeah, at times it can get a bit stressful out there.